Okay, so I have my EMF uh, detector again. So we'll be checking out the Model 3. This is the older model or older version of Model 3. Uh, this is the front area. As you know, there's a 12 volt underneath this cover. So we'll see if the front actually has any exposure to EMF. Nope. So here's the 12 volt battery. So slight uptick between one and three. So it's not that you're gonna be out here in the front often, but there's some emission of EMF there. We're gonna check the back seat because that's where the main high voltage battery pack plug is and we'll see if there's any emission of EMF for the rear passenger seat. Yeah, there's some here on the door seal. Sort of sort of high over 10. Nothing on the foot well. I'm wondering if... Yeah, there's nothing here. Nothing on the seat either. Alright. Whoa, what's going on here? So nothing, just on the door sill. I assume the, the seat has some insulation, but the door sill is just plastic. Very interesting. So let's go ahead and get into the driver's seat. All right, so in the driver's seat, Test the foot well. Nothing. All right. How about the wireless charger? Of course. Wow. So this wireless charger is a fast charging wireless charger, unlike the one that came with the Tesla vehicle. So that's why it's a lot higher. about three inches away you probably don't want to get near that uh, just charge your phone and take it out the outside here is safe how about this seat nothing let's check the autopilot controller or computer so interesting in the model 3 you're not getting much reading here from the EMF. I wonder because the car is not fully on. So let me put it in drive. Still zero. That's interesting. Let me try the seat heater because I know the seat heater in Model Y does emit some EMF. So seat heater is on. So this does have the Taptez seat cover and it's not showing any reading. Interesting, so extra insulation is blocking out. At least this seat cover is. Display-wise, uh, yep, still working. So 
slightly different. There's no emission from the glove box, below the glove box, where the computer is expected to be. How about the high voltage wire to the 12 volt from the main battery pack? It's located right here next to the filter. Nothing. So definitely driver's seat, still the safest place. nothing out here there's a cart reader here back here okay so this does emit some emf where the key card is placed okay but you're usually not exposed to that because you're you don't have any flush there unless when you're opening up this armrest nothing all right so it's safe to say that while in park and probably in drive the driver's seat is safe looks like the passenger shotgun seat is safe the rear seat where the seals at between the two seat it does emit some at least on the right side it emits some emf let's try this door sill nothing let's try the rear door sill on the left side So, what was that? So nothing on the left side. Um, definitely on the right side, that's where the main battery pack plug is at. So there's definitely some wires going along the door sill there. So this is quite different from what the Model Y. The Model Y seemed to, at least the newer version of the Tesla vehicle, it seems to emit slightly more EMF um, in the footwell for the passenger. And then while charging, we haven't tested this out for the three yet, but I assume it's the same. It should be the same results. Yeah, nothing, nothing out the ordinary. I mean, inside a gasoline vehicle, you probably won't have any much exposure uh, other than if you have your Bluetooth Wi-Fi on or hot spot. So yeah, back here, this is just a rear motor and then the front motor. So we'll test this out while we were driving and see if it's actually emitting anything. And this is for Model 3, for those that own Model 3. You're definitely safe in the driver's seat. While you're charging, you probably just wanna be in the driver's seat or the passenger seat in the front. You definitely don't wanna be in the rear as we saw earlier in other, uh, <clears throat> and videos for Model Y, there is EMF that is getting into the cabin while you're charging your vehicle. Okay, thanks for watching. Catch you all next time and be safe. Remember to subscribe.